Hey goons, what is up? Hell Pockets here for Game Goons TV with the first ever goon vlog or a pocket vlog or highway to hell pockets. I don't know what I'm gonna call this, but basically it's the vlog number one. And I want to start out by telling you I've got some news for you, various kinds. Uh, some good news, some bad news, some cool news, some maybe not so cool news. You know, just a lot of news basically. That's what I intend for this uh, little vlog segment to be about. Uh, before I get started though, I want you to make sure that you go over to our Teespring at teespring.com slash stores slash game dash goons and check out the new apparel that we've had made for us courtesy of resident art goon Meta Abe. Thanks a lot, buddy. You done outdid yourself this time. So I'm gonna start out with the bad news. I don't know if you've been watching my East Memories of Celseta playthrough. The numbers show that you're not. <laughs> Um, but uh, due to an unfortunate audio recording issue, um, yeah, I'm not going to be able to do that anymore. What is up, Goons? Hell Pockets here for Game Goons TV, and I am back with more East Memories of Salsetta. It's been a little while. I, it's, it's dead, Jim. Pack it up. It's done. Stick a fork in it. Um, but I learned a lot. I learned a lot doing this playthrough series, and that's what it was about. It wasn't really about finishing the game um, for the YouTube but it was about just like learning how to do let's plays and making these mistakes and there's probably gonna be more mistakes in the future but the ones that I've made I definitely learned from and I won't be making them again at least not in the same exact manner basically YouTube videos are a blow-up they say streaming is a blow-up but YouTube videos are almost equally a, a blow-up but I had a great time doing it and there'll be more I'll probably do East 8 honestly I've been wanting to do East 8 uh, so long and I streamed that for a little bit but I stopped and I wanted to make a YouTube series out of it so that'll probably be the next game that I do and uh, it'll benefit uh, incredibly from what I've learned doing Memories of Cell Set. Maybe I'll go back to Memories of Cell Set later on in the future uh, if people want me to play through it. I feel pretty comfortable in beating that game pretty quickly. So let me know if you want me to go back to it in the future, you know. I'm not saying it'll happen this year or even next year, but I definitely want to get back to it So as long as people want to watch it. Moving along into the good news, uh, other than the vlog existing, hey, inaugural vlog episode. So if you follow my Twitter, you'll notice that I've been going pretty ham on this thing called Lost Ark. Uh, Lost Ark is a Korean MMORPG that is about to enter its open beta testing phase and I've been following this game since I guess 2016. I feel like it's been announced longer than that. So I've been following Smilegate and all the trials that they've been through developing this game and how much they've been hyping everybody up around the world really for its release and it's pretty close. It's only going to be available in Korea of course with plans for it to be expanded to China. I think they've already got that in the works. And of course, everybody wants to know, when's it coming out in the West? When's it coming out global or just NA, really, North America, really? Um, that's all I ever hear about. And I, you know, I can't blame them. This game looks amazing. Uh, I haven't played it myself, but I plan to get in on the Korean open beta test with an account. You know, I'm going to actually finally bite the bullet and buy myself a Korean account and the VPN and all that shit. So I'm going to hopefully see what all the fuss is about. The classes look really cool. I haven't really gotten a lot of information from websites on how they play and who's strong and who's not. I know about the difficulty rating for a lot of the classes. Like the one class that I was actually the most interested in playing, the Devil Hunter. Turns out it's probably the hardest class to play. Just my fucking luck. Every game, I always get like the low tier character. Actually, no, I won't say that he's a low tier class. Maybe he's actually high mid or even mid. Maybe he's just really difficult to move maneuver with. So, you know, won't second guess the brother just yet. If you want to get some more resources on Lost Ark, I'll put some links down in the description. You can follow those to a website called Lost Ark Game, the Reddit, uh, some other YouTube channels. I'll put some links to other YouTube videos. And of course, you know, search it for yourself. It's, there's a plethora of information about this game. As far as English global release, um, I want to say that it's probably a good sign that the official channel for Lost Ark translated its open beta trailer um, into English. So, so that's a pretty good sign. The last time I saw like an MMO that got that kind of treatment uh, pretty early on in its life cycle was Tree of Savior. And that came out here super quick. Probably a little too quick by a lot of people's standards. But the point is it came out pretty damn quick. So I'm thinking maybe the wait for Lost Ark in the West may not be as long as we've been thinking it's going to be. So that's cool news, right? 
totally cheers you up about the memories of Cell Set of Failure. Sorry, guys. Uh, another good news, I finally got a chance to try out Red Dead Redemption. Uh, another good news, I've gotten a chance to try out Red Dead Redemption 2, and I'm not hating it so far. I like it. Uh, the controls are not that great. That's probably the worst thing about it, is the controls. I don't really mind um, everything else, but the controls are like, just, just ugh, dude irksome but i think that's also me just gotta i gotta get used to that you know i'm not gonna ding the game too much on the controls because i'm having a great time playing it still so the controls are not so bad that it's ruining the experience for me Best. i haven't slept in three days so i give you you're over here miss o'shea i'll show you the way mr morgan we put you in a room over here thank you miss grimshaw mr bell you're with the fellas over there what how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? <laughs> get hey, 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 hey! You know what, honestly, I'm not even mad they put that in there. <laughs> but yeah, so I, I, I'm not going to give like a ranking score because I'm not a review or anything. I'm not a game journalist, so I would say if you haven't tried out Red Dead Redemption 2, ch check it out. It's a pretty fun game. Uh, I would recommend it to all my friends and all my fans if I even have any fans. The goons, of course. Alright, that's gonna do it for me in my first vlog. This vlog series is probably gonna consist of a lot of different ideas coming together. Uh, I made a little video last year saying that my New Year's resolution was going to be to try more shit that floats around in my head, even if it fails. And this is a little, this is a part of that. Anyway, you guys have a good night. Thank you for watching. If you like what you saw, if you didn't like what you saw, leave a like or a dislike, a comment down in the comment section. Let us know how you feel. We want to hear from you. And always remember to grind hell, Satan.